back in the winner's circle in 2021. He told us yesterday he feels as good as he ever has in terms of his game. His fourth child, little girl, wanted to be there. Early open for four second. Remember, 50 bonus pins for that high game. 25 talented bowlers. We're gonna see this again. Watch out, chop to six. Left out. Miami. <laughs> Miami. <laughs> Oh my god. Eye, 3610. And his third miss fair of the game. What is happening right now with EJ Tapper? What's happening? He's. Can't cover. He's, tra he's trapped. Good start. Yeah. And he fouled there. Oh, that that doesn't count. 38 feet. Sure it is. Sure it is. Three seat shorter, left lane. Mm. Navarese doesn't no. convert. No way he would have been able to last in the loser's bracket like he did. Whoa, Jesus. whoa, whoa. We out by just seven pins last night. You're late. Seven pins, that's all Sterner gets on strike. Left lane, Sterner needs some magic. Pass. That's high. Wow. And held last year to go. Baby split, 310, no. No. Chops and leaves the 10 pin. Jacob, a four time member of Team USA. Right lane to left, he gets going here, second half of this step left. Uh. Whoa. A chop takes down the nine, leaves. Oh, gotcha. Oh, the mask. There Pull the mask oh, down, and oh. there it goes. Oh. Oh. Right oh, boy. There it goes. 2019 was a dream season. This year's just been so tough for him for a lot of reasons. Just can't find that look. Three. Just two, Jacob. He'll get eight, he'll get the win. And he'll climb the ladder to take on B.J. Moore next. Moore, Kyle Sherman used an extreme, extremely strong piece of equipment. Dude, like hook somewhere. Whoa. Please. Lots to cover. Misses the head pin. But great in the team event concept as well. He was a pretty quiet guy, and then more trouble as he misses the pocket again. One, two, eight. Recovers very well. Good shot. At least it looked like it until it. Linden Wood. Baby split. No. Chop yeah. leaves the 10. Open frame. Lead balloons for him. One amateur in our event. And the Goshen comes in high and leaves a split. Got to kick it across the deck. Does not get the two-year exemption. He's not on the tour. Way high. Screen. Ten pins stands for Brian Bogosian, ever major at the Tournament of Champions in Uncasville. He's 0-1 against Healy Jr. In the 2002 Earl Anthony Class. Over 7,000. As Bogosian finishes up, that was set back in the mid-90s at Joe Louis Arena. And all the folks watching back home, New England Bowlers Association, he wanted to say hello to. I've got to be pleased with this showing. Yeah, and I've actually been to one of their events. It's a phenomenal tournament. Get lucky. It didn't. Leaves one behind. And so many balls are just diving through the face on. Bot when we had the four players going at once. That was in the tenth frame. 
And there you see a good example of what's happened to him. This ha Gonna take a run at uh, he just gutted the darn thing. I can't feel more for Darren Tang and what he's going through. I remember my first time on television, 150. Really? Because you had a pretty sweet record on TV. I shot 154 against uh, David Ozio, Tucson. And then uh, he went up to both against Mike Durbin for the title, and Durbin shot 150. <laughs> Windy and cold inside. Yeah, come on. Oh, well, yeah, how uh, about it? Did he get a message Just or so Darren Tang was so solid when all four. When the showboat doubles, making his second appearance in three weeks. And it's looking pretty good. Oh, it's a little hot. People want to know about wood. Let's see if he picks it up. Looks light, oh. and it is. Oh. All right, let's see if he can come back good with shot. a strike. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's in trouble now. Last night. Well, he gets a, a little bit of a break. It doesn't move. It is perfect. Very still hit. Very good hand action. He has got no break. Very, he's going to give this a shot. Oh. See if he needs to make a good shot here. Is he going to double? Looks high, and it is. He's had trouble with that lane the whole. Picks up a couple of them, but uh, the way Ozio's been playing. Is he going? Smooth release. Yep. A little up. Oh, oh it's hard. He's going to give it a shot. Has a Has chance. Has a chance. Oh. No, he knew. He turned away right away. Got a little left to target. Oh, that a four split. Nine. The seven pin app, it did not hit the four. Good shot on this. Hooked away again. All right, we'll be right. Mike's mastered this lane. Another good shot here. Oh, and he leaves a solid one. Very important pickup here. We got it right. Oh, he oh, throws no. it in the gutter. And the third open for Mike Durbin. That really hurt Mike. In the top five, half of them. Incredible. <laughs> oh, that's a joke. Oh, did that hang a wicked left fast. Attempt that he's uh, staring at. Another bounce. Mm -hmm. And chop it. Yep. Spare. Still not able to get into the time. It's picked up. Right at target. Sean Rash can certainly empathize. He had his struggles as well. How about that? Follows the same hit up. First shot. As did Prather. They both come back to those same lanes. Back his tour rep. Oh, he got around it. He got around it. You can see it. They, they had that extra hop in their step. Yeah. They're all jacked up to see the number one player on the planet. Expecting to be below. Good shot. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. Let's just uh, get what? game what? one to Prather. We're going to go to game two with Prather up. All finished. Top start. Heading on the show. Top split. Trying to kick it across the deck. Also on TV in Chicago. Finished fourth. And another difficult split. The oil down the lane. When you carry the oil down the lane, you get back. Trying to pick up a split here. Look out. He whiffs on all for this week. The rest will come on tour points in that 50. Tour. Where he lost Parker in seven in the round of eight. Trying to kick it across the deck to the seven pin. And cannot do that. Three. Oh. Let's try and mix it up. Strike, spare to start for Kent. Very heavy. Oh. Missed the head pin. Great pickup! 
well below the 4.81 average per term of 300 games. How about it? Oh. Mm. Game effort, but not the best of games for Doug Kent. Two Jones's response in the third. Uh oh. Four, six, seven, ten, and misses them all. I know that Tommy was trying to throw it hard, get the velocity up to try to get lucky and bounce that out. But... Game effort to knock down that ten, but this will end a seven game televised win streak for him. And it's held for him. He was trying to go in between them. And Chris and Tommy had a little wager there. Right. He does the smart thing and just gets. Bears are freaking people out today. Here. Oh, God. If only for a solid eight pin Ooh. in the seventh frame. I've been on the other side of that. I know what that's like. No fun. Enough pins to get him to the TV show. See the strike percentage numbers. And that's off the mark, too. Another light hit switch. Chicago land last summer. That's how he got his exemption. Tough spare cannot convert. Ups and downs for Lowshedder. This week in match play, that's a high shot, so he over. It was a very big challenge for him, and look out, the double was. Saw his wife Aaron earlier. She's a bowler herself. Fortunately, he just can't get the range going. Not an easy mark, and look out. Junior Olympic team in 2001. Definitely an up and comer. Chris Lowshader will learn from this experience and has seven top ten finishes. This is going to be a great match coming up. Thank you, guys. Thank you. And to the midway point of this semifinal. Look at it. Wow, that was way Jeez off. Whiz. Ah! And he knew it. An open. You said to 18 now. See the difference, average in the wins and losses. That's high again, look out. Oh, it's harder. Now he'll take the lesser of two evils there and grab to the competition. Wasn't even close. Back to Wiseman, who just can't find the ball reaction. Folks, he sees Chris Barnes and Lonnie Walchek on our skills challenge. Shoot Got left handed. Yesterday morning. And I'll tell you what, they shoot much better lefty than I do. And I'm left handed. Right 